Hello everybody, my name is Jennifer, professional psychic, and in today's video, you're going to find out if you would survive the zombie apocalypse. Alright you guys, obviously this video is just for funsies, and don't take it super seriously, but I like to do these once in a while just to shake things up. If you like my videos, and you enjoy my content, don't forget to like this video. Stop and like it right now, it would do me a great favor, and it would help you feel good about helping me out. Also, uh, subscribe, ring the bell, all that fun stuff. Let's get into the video. So you guys, we are going to find out today if you are going to survive the zombie apocalypse. Do you guys believe that we will one day have a zombie apocalypse? Do you guys like zombie movies? What is your favorite zombie movie? I don't know what mine is. I definitely like Shaun of the Dead a lot. That is one of the top, top ones. But there's so many good zombie movies. I, it's hard to, it's hard to pick. But Shaun of the Dead is definitely like one of my faves. So I want you to uh, lay out some cards here for you guys. How many cards did I put down? Three. Okay. So, ooh, did you guys get to see what that was? No. Okay. Cool. No peeking. All right. Let's get my bag of tricks. Let's do this. Of course, all these are going to be time stamped, but I would really like it if you watch the whole video because I think you'd enjoy it. <laughs> let's get these down and let's do this one. All right. So think about the zombie apocalypse. Think about you yourself as a person. And I want you to focus on these three decks of cards. And which one would you pick? The little piggy, this beautiful citrine, or this amethyst? Take your time, make your pick. And let's begin. I'm going to pull these aside just for a, a, a moment. And let's see if you, deck number one, are going to survive the zombie apocalypse. Whooping. <laughs> All right, here's what I'm getting. Yeah, I feel like you will. This is what I'm getting about this. You are very resourceful, but I also feel you have very good instincts. You yourself are probably psychic. And I feel like you would know to get out of Dodge before anything happened. You would be the, ter the person to pick up on things before everybody else did and you'd probably get you and your family out of the way, the harm's way before things got too dicey and too crazy. Uh, so because of your, your wits and your intuition, I think that you would survive the zombie apocalypse. Congratulations. Let us see deck number two. Will you survive the zombie apocalypse with this pretty, you could probably kill a zombie with this thing, it's so big. All right, let's see if you'll survive the zombie apocalypse. Whoa, whoa, okay. Uh, unfortunately, I do not see you surviving the zombie apocalypse. Whilst I do think that you are very intelligent and most likely very strong and probably a good little fighter, I feel like you are very affected by what's going on around you and you would be susceptible to whatever the group mob mentality is. And so it would largely, rep you know, depend on the group that you're with. But you often tend to see the worst case scenarios. You often tend to worry about things and obsess about things and kind of stress yourself out about things. And sometimes that could get you in trouble because your mind isn't super clear. And so because of that, I do not see you surviving the zombie apocalypse. I'm so sorry. I apologize. All right, guys, deck number three. Are you going to survive the zombie apocalypse? Not only are you going to survive the zombie apocalypse, but you're probably going to become the leader of a clan or camp or whatever. You're going to be, you're going to be living for the zombie apocalypse. I feel like you, you know, you are going to have to learn a couple of hard lessons because you can be a little stubborn yourself. And sometimes it's hard for you to be a team player because you're so used to being the leader. Uh, so that can be challenging. And you also like to play it safe, which is can also be a little challenging because sometimes you're going to miss out on opportunities because you're playing it safe. But I feel very strongly that you will, you know, despite maybe making some mistakes here or there in the beginning, you will survive the zombie apocalypse and help this world rebuild into a Zootopia. A Zootopia? A Utopia. <laughs> we don't want a Zootopia. We want a Utopia. So yeah, that's, that's what I get about you. So... There you guys go. This was a very, very silly video, but I wanted to do it just for fun, and I hope you liked it. Take care.